by Noah Zebra. I'm Therese Muggy. I'm out of the Minneapolis St. Paul area. And the zebra condition is LCH, which is Lagenhorn cell histiocytosis. Lagenhorn cell histiocytosis is when Lagenhorn cells um, multiply rapidly. And it presents itself either through a skin disease or through lesions on your bones. Um, affects little ones uh, up to the age of 14. I can only speak from my perspective um, where the tumor was in the, the skull area removed. And then the follow-up is um, like you would do for cancer treatment. So it was followed up with an oncologist. It was the same frequency as you would if you were in remission of cancer. So you would be three months, six months follow-up, and it'd be the whole MRI. Once we got him in with the pediatrician and said he had something going on here, we are so fortunate because our pediatrician listened. So from when he came and saw his pediatrician, to when after the CT scan, we got him into Gillette Hospital here because um, the pediatrician said something's not right after that, that scan. And then we went and had an MRI, they could diagnose it. And then he got with the pediatric neurosurgeon. And so I would say from when that first one was, when they got that diagnosis to when um, he had the surgery, it went fast, it was two weeks. Fortunately, the pediatric uh, neurosurgeon had seen other cases of that. It was the months leading up to it that we didn't know what was going on, that we couldn't figure out why he was more lethargic and he had more headaches. I had never heard of LCH before. And we literally had to um, let other individuals know this is LCH, this is what it means. I didn't think it was as rare as it is uh, until... I started doing a little bit more research. What I wish everyone knew about LCH is that they knew about LCH. Like if you said it and it was more well known. Our family is extremely fortunate that we live in, live in an area where we have great health care and access to great health care. It was extremely difficult to know what to do, how to manage all of this. And it was scary. If he didn't have a little bump right here, we probably would have even got this diagnosis as quickly. This disease progresses quickly in my understanding. Whatever we can do to make it known out there that there is a condition or a disease called LCH. The year of the zebra campaign matters a lot to me because I've been affected by a zebra uh, disease. My family's been affected by a zebra disease. Um, my son's group of friends have been affected by a zebra disease. That's just one zebra disease and we know how many of them there are and we have to get the word out because as someone either who has it or a family member who's there supporting those individuals that do have the disease, it's such a scary thing. And you're thinking there has to be a way of how we can help those that have these diseases. And it's incumbent upon us to ensure that, that these diseases, we can help find a cure. It really matters to me. And I'm so proud of what Shiv has done in this, bringing this attention to everyone. Um, so appreciative and, and it really needs to be shouted out to the world to say, how do we help those that have this, these very unique zebra diseases? To learn more, visit www.osmosis.org zebra.